Jamie, a last minute winner at Woking, uh, what do you make of that? Oh, it's fantastic, isn't it? You know, away days, it's a tough, it was a tough, the conditions were really, really testing at times um, to come here, especially after, you know, going on down so early. It's given us, and we felt comfortable that we're going to create chances with the attacking players that we have, so it's just to stay in the game as long as we can, and we can, you know, put our mark on what we did. What, what, you just mentioned it there, what was it like to play, and it was quite a cagey affair at times. Yeah, the wind's fishy first half, um, and I think that's what I tell them in the second half as well, and they had to deal with it as well, but um, yeah, it was, it was really, you know, a real, real tough battle out there. Um, they got a big physical side, and you know, I think when we matched that and then when the quality came, we kind of outshone and the boys attacked that different. How pleased are you from the character show from the lads obviously getting pegged back uh, early on and then showing the character to, to come through and get the, the late goal? Yeah, it, it's, it's great, it's great. It, honestly, we, um, on the pitch out there, we felt, we felt like that, you know, we, heads didn't drop. We were just like, okay, this weather the storm, they're going to have a spell, they're going to catch us, you know, catch us cold, from a set play, so that's what they like to play off. Um, but we just knew we got the ability and the technical players that could, uh, you know, go and win us a game. You've been involved uh, a lot recently uh, since coming back from injury, and, and we've had quite a few positive results along the way. How much confidence does that give you personally? Yeah, it's great. I've had to, you know, play myself to fitness, you know, because we haven't really got a reserve side or anything like that. So yeah, the management faith in me to, you know, get myself up to match fitness and match sharpness, and I think it's slowly, yeah, slowly coming, you know. So hopefully, back in the year we'll be all right. Uh, and what were the fans like to play in front of today? Because they, they, they made their voices heard right throughout. They did, yeah, and they gave us that belief, you know, especially towards the end, going up there and you can hear them cheering, you know, it gives us the boys, especially the, the, the boys at the back, you know, come on, let's go get our heads on this kind of thing. So, no, the, the fans have been great. And, and how important is it now that we uh, take this momentum going forward with us now and into a busy Christmas period? Yeah, it's massive, it's massive, and we'll see where we are come the end of the Christmas period. And with uh, Aston Oxford making t two or three really good saves, uh, m m must be nice to have, have a, a goalkeeper like that behind you. Yeah, he's been brilliant. He's been brilliant since he's come in. Um, yeah, it, and that was it. As a, as a team, defensively, we just knew we needed to, you know, stay in the game. For point, you know, whether they're storm, whether they're the moments that they had, and I think we, we did that. I think the, the, the result shows that. So um, yeah, Oxford's been brilliant like that. Thanks for your time. Thank you.